We're getting closer, there's a few more bits gone on. Hi, Tony here, just wanted to give you a very quick update. There's a few extra bits that have gone onto the bike. Probably not jobs that are big enough to worthy their individual videos. So I'll just show you the bits that uh, have been added starting with this lovely fuel cap. So when I did the tank install, I didn't have the cap in place. And this is the one that I've chosen to go for, which is just the spun aluminium version. And I think you'll agree with the silver stripe, that one works particularly well on this tank. Next up was a set of carb tops. These I really needed to take the tank off again to get to the screws. Putting a new one on is not too bad because Motone supplier Allen bolts were those which are fairly easy to get to but the original cross headed screws meant taking that lovely tank back off again but I think you'll agree those things look very very cool. The controls have been bolted back ready for the new grips that's also enabled me to put the Motone brake master cylinder top cap on again a really nicely machined piece looks much nicer than the stock version and that's just a simple two bolt fitment. For grips I've chosen a set of Built World Kung Fu grips I had these on my old Motor Guzzi and absolutely love them uh, so they'll go back on there as soon as I get a chance and finally, although I really love this front sprocket cover, Motone sent me one of their new versions, so I thought I'd stick that on and show you what that looks like too. And there is the new, rather more blingy sprocket cover. Ties in with the brushed aluminium here. Follows on the same style as the side panels. And uh, it looks nice. I'm not quite sure which I prefer. I think I may well go back to putting the original one back on. But I thought, as this one had come through from Motone, I'll show you what it looks like. As I say, a very quick update just to show you some of the smaller parts that have got onto the bike. Uh, the next video will have a little bit more of a major update. I've still got the TKC 80 tyres to fit on there. I've got a front brace to fit. I'm probably going to take the rear mudguard off and paint that gloss black now. Uh, the grips have got to go on and we've got the exhaust to do yet. So still plenty more to come. I'll put links to all of those parts in the notes down below. There will be links in the end for you to click to go to other videos and all that leaves me to say is thanks for watching and until next time take care ride safe i'll see you soon bye yeah